Sue Barker was not overly happy with where she presented Wimbledon from on Wednesday. Sue Barker was not best pleased to be thrust outside by the BBC in near 25 degree heat to present Wimbledon on Wednesday. The UK is set for a heatwave in the coming days and temperatures have already started to soar at SW19. Barker, who will leave her role as BBC's lead presenter of the tournament after Sunday's final matches, headed up the coverage ahead of the remaining two men's quarterfinals. She sat in the blazing sun alongside former Wimbledon favourites Tim Henman and Pat Cash. The trio discussed the upcoming matches between Nick Kyrgios and Christian Guerin, and Rafael Nadal and Taylor Fritz. Henman and Cash were relieved to be relieved of their punditry duties for the time being after their preview of the men's matches was over. However, Barker was still set to be out in the elements to discuss the women's quarters. The 66-year-old admitted she regretted her decision to wear black as she said goodbye to Henman and Cash at the end of their stint. And she also wished the BBC instead put her in a cool studio. Barker said, OK well I'll let you feel a bit more comfortable now because I am going to say thank you very much and get back in the air conditioning. While well, be talking about the ladies' quarterfinals in a moment, Johanna Conta and Caroline Wozniacki will be joining me for that. But it's really hot here. I've certainly worn the wrong colored jacket. It's very hot. I thought I'd be in my nice air-conditioned studio but I am not. Barker then asked BBC weather presenter Carol Kirkwood if the warm spell was here to stay. She said, Carol, is it going to be this hot for the rest of the day? And Kirkwood revealed it would be only getting hotter later this week. She replied, yes, yes it is Sue and in fact it's going to get hotter over the next few days. After 30 years of service to the BBC's coverage of Wimbledon, Barker will be calling it a day this week. The former A Question of Sport presenter was honoured by John McEnroe on Centre Court on Sunday. Her long-standing colleague said, Sue, one final word. On behalf of all the players, I just want to say that we're going to be lost without you. After 30 years of covering this tournament magnificently, please give it up for Sue Barker.